Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, welcome. Um, so today, another little job for the ranger. Um, it's another lovely spring morning, uh, beautiful blue skies, um, and I've pressure washed the underside of the truck last night, left it all to, to dry. So today, uh, today's little job is, um, I'm gonna be applying something called Lanogard, which I saw some reviews on online. And uh, let me show you, the box has arrived. Um, the box has arrived, you can see what we get in there. So it seems pretty well packed. So you get the uh, instructions on how to use it, which is good. We get the hose that goes in the bottle. We get the actual spray gun it's th itself. It's very well packed. of uh, two litres of line guard and we also get the grease but this you can put this on any joins or any areas that need a bit more uh, protection I think, yeah that's everything in the box so let's get the box out of the way so this is what we've got so So yeah, what I'll do is I'll put this together, I'll read the instructions, which is always handy, because I think that goes in the uh, in the top there, you have the pipe, and then that pipe will go in there. So I'm going to set all this up, I'll see you in a second. But the other thing I'm planning on using is, um, is I've got this head strap for my camera, but I'm going to stick this on my head so you can see what I'm doing. And I've also got a uh, um, face mask that I'll probably be wearing, so you're not going to be able to see all the smiles on my face as I'm underneath the truck, but you can imagine how much I'm enjoying it. See you in a while. Bye. Right, here we go. So I've got the uh, lance set up. All it has to do is, is this had a tube coming out of it. What we've got to do is take that tube off, put the, the longer tube in. So this, this just literally pulls out the bottom there. Put the tube, the longer tube, into that end. Tighten, screw this white piece onto the green piece put the, uh, the other end of the tube into the um, bottom of the lanyard guard and um, there's a little clip on the top here that means it's like quite pushed up it's quite tight so it means the the tube is, is kind of forced to the bottom which is really handy so I've got all this in place it is a little bit chilly today so it's a little bit it's a little bit cold it's probably I don't know the sun's out but it's probably uh, well, I don't know maybe 10 degrees so what I'm going to do one recommendation is what you can do is you can take the, the lanyard um, I'm going to put this in a um, tub of hot water so just to um, warm it up a little bit more because it is a little bit nippy but I'll stick on my head mount and I'll uh, get cracking hopefully that'll work see you in a minute Bye.
we go. So, uh, not the best idea to do Lano Guard with a camera on, on your head because uh, I don't know how much of that's going to come out because a lot of it probably went on the lens, but I haven't checked yet. But there we go. That was literally 15, 20 minutes maybe. Um, let me show you under here. Under the real arch wheel arches. Um, yeah, looking good. I'm going to leave it to dry for a bit. Um, let it dry. And I'm going to go back under and just make sure I've missed any any bits. Um, it smells not that bad. It just smells like it smells like polish, to be honest. Uh, it's not an offensive smell. There you go. Looking under there, not looking good. Um, the last arch. There you go. If I drop down down here. I'm going to show you the underside. This is looking much better. Hopefully you can oh, tip you upside down. There you go. That's the underside done. I think I've got most of it to be honest. From here I can't see any bits I've missed. I've still got about a litre left. So uh, there we go. So if you're bored on a Sunday morning that's what I do. Buy some Lana, buy some Lana guard, spray it on your truck, and it will change your life. See you on the next one. Take care. Bye. So you're probably wondering, I've uh, applied the Lana guard, but I didn't actually take the spare wheel off. So the other side of this, where the spare wheel goes underneath hasn't actually been touched yet. And you're right. So I've just read the manual and. Uh, there you go, this is the spare wheel out, which I'm going to give that a clean as well before I put that back. And uh, yeah, so I'm going back under. We've got uh, about a quarter of a, um, a bottle left. Um, little tip next time, make sure you wear gloves. Uh, just wash my hands and this stuff is like, it doesn't come off. And also on the camera as well, so that's a bit, use a bit of detergent and it'll come off eventually. But uh, yeah, I'm going to stick you on the side while I go under, not take you with me on my head. I don't know if that really works. I'll see you in a second. Bye.